I'm feeling good and uh, yeah, about as ready as I've ever been. There are very few mountain climbers in the Alaska range in January, but Lonnie Dupree is on a mission. He wants to climb Mount Hunter, which is about 5,700 feet shorter than Denali, but can be much more dangerous, especially alone. Dupree felt that danger firsthand when he fell into a crevasse during a solo attempt in 2017. I thought, oh, this ground's kind of funny here. Made a mistake and took a, took a step and just went down and I had my ax in my hand. His ice ax caught the edge of what appeared to be a bottomless hole. With no one to rope to, Dupree was on his own. He managed to take his backpack off one-handed and then wiggled out. Stood up and just uh, composed myself and felt a little sick to my stomach. and. It shook me up so much that I just called the expedition and got out of there. I kind of believe in that uh, cliche of getting back on the horse. From the air, Dupree gets his first glance at what he's up against, a massive ice fall full of crevasses. Another climber on board, Joost Kobosch, doesn't like what he sees. I didn't really see a good route in the crevasses. Uh, I'm gonna stick left. I, I was I'm gonna go left. left, but left also. Yeah, both bad. Dupree plans to go slow. He has food and fuel for 19 days that he can stretch to 25. Large homemade skis and an aluminum pole will help keep him out of crevasses. It's heavily crevassed and very broken this year, but I'm gonna go around and give it a shot. Sleeping for weeks outside at 50 below might sound uncomfortable at best, but Dupree seems to do just fine. When you go winter camping and you come back, you think about how can I make things more comfortable? <laughs> All right, here we go. It's not about suffering, it's about doing a project and coming back and enjoying it. His second attempt at Mount Hunter is now underway. John Thane, KTVA 11 News.